Okay guys, Sammy here, playing some more Project Zomboid. So, after Jill died, we have to start a new game. So, I actually asked on Twitter for some name suggestions. Got a couple back, but they weren't subscribers and they they didn't really know that I've been naming my characters after after other video game characters. So, I'm going to go with Joel Miller. Um Let's just make him look awesome. Black here, I think. That'll do, that'll do. Right, away we go. So, here we go. We're going to go construction worker again. And... I really liked Strong. It was really good for carrying more stuff. Um, and then we've got to... Do a little... Do a couple of negative ones, so... Slow running speed. No, we don't want that. Broding is quite good, I think. Isn't it like a light drinker one? You yeah, like drinker. I don't drink alcohol, so... Can't go up for some reason. Why can't I go up? And what else do we want? Short, we can do short-tempered. Get rid of Broding. We'll try that. Let's try it. Here we go. Away we go. So hopefully we get a good spawn here. Hopefully we can get up to the warehouse pretty quickly. So that's where all the action is at. Can't click to continue here. Here we go. And we have the info here. The survival guide. We don't need that. Joel is pro. It's got no top on though. We don't start with one. Okay. So it looks like we've started in the trailer park. So what we want is some food, some weapon, well, a weapon. And I might put a vest on. Don't like walking around topless. So let's equip. And we want some carrying bags too. Let's rip up this sweater for some bandages. Just in case. Let's check out if there's any food in here. Empty mug. Oh, is there a fridge? There's a small one over here. Here we go. There we go. We've got some food. Um, we can use a frying pan as a weapon for now. That'll be our weapon for now. And we'll take the dog food as well, just in case we really get desperate. Did I see any um, can openers in here? I didn't. Okay, so we don't really have a supply of food here. Or a bag. We really need a bag to start off with. Um, did I put that vest on? I thought I did. No, we didn't. There we go. Look a bit better now, Joel. So let's go for a little walk here. Oh, so... I'm gonna get used to not being good at sneaking again. Let's try out this frying pan, eh? Oh, that worked quite well. Worked very well, in fact. Let's check out this little box here. the lighter. Let's check the door. Oh! These people didn't lock their door when the zombies came. Let's have a look in here. We'll loot that. We've got a drink bottle. That's good. So I'm just going to drink that soda and fill it up with water. So we don't have to worry about that. That's cool. Let's jump in here. He's stuck on walls. Is that this massive shower? Ah, oh, open the door. There we go. Good work, Joel. Okay. So I'd like a baseball bat. I'm not finding one so far. 
Let's have a look around here. There's a crawler there. I know your games. There's a zombie in there. We don't really want to have to fight zombies, do we? Might check out these bins over here. Yeah, there's a couple in there. See what people have been throwing out in the uh, in the trailer park. Empty bottle. Why would you waste a bottle like that, eh? Oh, look at this. Got a saw, some nails. That's pretty good. Ah, oh, some shotgun shells. I'm aware that I might run out of room if I just start grabbing everything I find that will be useful. Oh, lots of shotgun shells. Wouldn't mind that spade either. Probably use that as a weapon instead of what I've got. I can hear some banging. I think a zombie's after me somewhere. Okay. Let's keep going. So doing what? Have I got my shovel out? <laughs> I can't see it. Okay, let's try this door. Oh, the zombie is too close. Is he dead? He is. So the shovel is quite good, good for a weapon. Oh, hold Sam to jump through. A little break from Project Zomboid, so <laughs> if I do stupid stuff like that, I'll blame it on that. Or oh, cooking pot, we want there in the long run. I just want one can opener. Probably don't need to be grabbing stuff like cooking pot right now, but. Oh, here we go. We've got some plastic bags. Equip secondary. Can we grab another one and equip that on my back or anything? No, I can't. But now at least we've got... A, oh, is this one better? Capacity trial weight reduction 50. Yeah, it's way better. So we'll equip that one secondary and we'll start loading that up with our food. Tuna. Grab that flour too. Okay, so what have we got? Dog food to go in there. Beef jerky, bread and butter. Oops, I'm pressing shift instead of control. So that's good. Don't need this frying pan anymore. Um, chocolate. I think that's all for now. And we can loot all this into uh, our food bag. Okay, so let's keep moving. Doing quite well here. Wouldn't mind a backpack. School bag, look at that. <laughs> Perfect. Okay, let's put all our other non essentials. That can go in the food bag. So, same with the cooking pot. So, let's put all the other non essential stuff in there for now. Oh, the shotgun shells. Um, we'll fill up that empty water bottle and then put it in the food bag. Okay, so it looks like you can still fill up stuff from a little way away. They haven't fixed that yet, but I'm sure they will. Now we need... Right, well, it's only three o'clock. I was thinking we need we need a place to stay the night. But I think we'll Oh I'll leave you alone, it's gonna knock you over the back of the head, but you're okay. Uh we'll jump in here. Um so yeah, I was thinking we might need somewhere to stay the night, but I think we've still got a little bit of time left in the day to do some more looting. Just be careful around here. We're doing okay though. Oh, antidepressants, we'll take those. 
You know when Joel might get a little bit depressed. Hope Joel doesn't get depressed. Okay, let's put that into our food bag. Oh, it's some chips. So, yep, there we go. Let's just jump out of here. Can't get back out that window I came in. So, maybe they'll fix that when you jump through a window into furniture. You used to get stuck, but maybe they'll fix that. We can probably test it pretty well on this one here, because this is kind of... I'm just looking at that zombie, but... We'll test that on this window here, we'll see what happens when I jump through. Oh, there's zombie sounds around. Oh, I have a feeling there's zombies in this house there, yeah, the music started up, so... <laughs> it's normally a good indication that there's something going on. Um, let's have a look. Let's have a little quick look through this door. Can't see them here. Let's quickly check out the food. Oh, maybe it's over there. Put all this. Dead rat. Ew. Lovely. So we still go in here. Put a cereal. Nothing useful for me in there. I have a feeling there's someone in this door here. Let's have a quick look. No, it's clear. I'm not sure where the banging's coming from then. Let's see if we can avoid this zombie out here. No, we can't. Double check there's no more around me. Take him out. This shovel is actually really good. Oh, and it's raining. Maybe we should stay in here the night. These, um... These windows are huge, though. There's tons... There's tons of them. I'm not going to be able to cover them up. I'm getting a bit hungry, so we'll have a banana. Um... Just thinking, I can sleep here too, can't I? So maybe I should just sleep here. It's only like one window kind of close. Let's at least close all the doors. Okay. So, so, and it's only six o'clock. Maybe I shouldn't wait here for the night. Decisions, eh? Alright, let's keep moving, let's keep moving. Come on, Joel, a little bit of water won't hurt you. Don't really want to be in the trailer park overnight. The shovel is really good. I think it's just about as good as the axe. Which is... Uh, I'm not going to use the axe this time when I... Um, when I find one. Because I just kept breaking them last time. And then... I had to find a new one, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to start using other weapons, even though the axe is really good. I'm going to start using, like, nailed baseball bats and stuff like that, so then, then I'm not breaking my axe all the time, because axes are a little bit rare. Ah, oh, get out of here, zombie. I don't know what this area here is, this is kind of not really where I want to be. Don't get injured, Joel. Oh, get out of here. This is a bit too early to be doing that. Oh, no. Looks like a few more spawn down here, too. Not a good start here, Sam. What are you doing? Okay, come on. Let's lose them around the corner here. Just smash a window here. Oh, that's going to attract more than I want, though. This guy's the slow moving one, so we'll just kind of slowly shuffle off here. There's one running up there for some reason. Now I have been here. And it's 8 o'clock now, so maybe I should jump in here for the night. I think I will. Oh, there's one outside that window there though. 
He's seen me. Okay, so we're not staying in here for the night. Okay, where can we go for the night? Maybe this end one here? We just have to risk it because we're getting tired, wet. Joel's not happy. Oh shit. Didn't see you buddy, sneaking, sneaking up on me. Hopefully that didn't attract any. Get inside Joel. Alright, we're getting in. Now let's, it's nine o'clock, so let's just, just fast forward a little bit. Oh, there's one at the window there. Okay. So I'm going to risk this. So I'm going to, I'm going to play a little bit risky here. It's ten o'clock. Let's go to sleep. Come on, Joel. There we go. This could be a bit risky. No windows are broken yet. So we made it. Could count ourselves a little bit lucky there. We'll have a breed. Okay, so out we go. Let's close this door. It's raining again. Is it raining? I can't see the raindrops, but I can hear them. So let's get out of the uh let's get out of the trailer park here. We'll go find me kill him. We'll go find a a house to start boarding up or maybe I'm not sure I'm not really sure where I am to be honest. Who am I going here? I have a feeling I'm going out of town. Hey guys, sorry about that. I kind of got a little bit lost there, so I'm probably going to cut most of that out of the video. Um, but I actually ended up running down the railroad track because I kind of knew where they lead up. And now we are in Berry Heaven, so we're going to grab some berries while we're here. I'm going to load up on them actually. If you don't know, berries are like, like the superfood of Project Sunboard. Live off berries for a good couple of months. Oh, what's going on here? Oh, there's a zombie at the bush there, okay. Settle down. Settle down, Joel. We're all good. Okay, so our bag is full of berries. Let's fill up this one here as well. Getting a bit wet out here. Sorry about that, Joel. Can't do anything about it right now. All my berries there. Oh, and this one's coming for us. I seem to go in and out of um, view quite frequently now. Is that a change or... Is that just because... My guy's new character. I'm not sure. I think I think it's a change. Hopefully we don't catch cold here. We'll grab those. Okay, I think that's enough. So we've got how many we've got there? Thirty. Fifteen there, we've got forty five and a lot of other food, so Oh, it stopped raining now, so we may as well finish loading up. Ah. Uh, yeah, we may as well. We've got, we've got a couple more room in this bag, so let's grab a few more. May as well while we're here. Get some more. There we go, so we must be full now. Okay. So let's keep moving. So I think what I'll do now is I'll just find a house. What's that following us? Is that, is that, my, is that my beard? I think it is. Yeah, that's my beard. So when he runs, his beard kind of follows behind him. That's cool. It's kind of like I've got a little friend. Um, so... 
we actually have one of our two safe houses just around the corner here so we'll go there and we'll offload our stuff for now um, should I check out that house? I'll check it out, I'll probably check out this house in the next episode for now though, so we'll just jump into our first safe house oh there we go so if you didn't watch my last series, I kind of my, my last playthrough, sorry. I kind of had two safe houses, and one of them was the house just up here. Um, it got overrun pretty quickly, even though we did have walls up. Um, so, I think we'll probably use this house as a safe house again. It's pretty good because it's already got tons of fences around it, so it's only got this little entrance right here. We are hungry at the moment, so we'll just grab a snack. Beef jerky. So we're going to use this one of our safe houses. Oh, it's locked. And it sounds like there's a zombie in there. Okay, let's just deal with this zombie. Oh. Good work, Joel. Okay. So let's put our perishables into the fridge here. Shift click is the best way to do it. We've got orange soda there, we don't really need to offload that. Didn't work. Okay, so we've got our perishables in there. Let's load up this one here with our other food that we don't need right now. Chips, chocolate, come on, select it. There we go. Just, just a little bit of inventory management. And we have berries in here as well, so let's drop berries into there. Yeah, full again. Can't hold that much, can it? Don't need the can opener. Okay, and we're really tired. So, I'm going to end the episode here, guys. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. And I shall see you all next game. GG.